Hi, my name is Carrie Tominia. I am an EFT expert and love and dating coach. And this episode of Tapping Into Love is all about shifting your energy, shifting your vibe after receiving an unwanted dick pic. Lots of my clients and myself deal with this travesty of modern dating on a regular basis. I don't know when men became so uncreative, and I'm not sure at what point they think it's a great idea to send a surprise picture of their junk. But this tapping video is here to help shift your energy after that happens to you. Um, whether it be a surprise, whether it be a violation, whatever emotions are there after this happens, a disappointment, it often is, um, this very short tapping video is gonna help you acknowledge those emotions, change the energy, and also help shift your energy upward so that you don't need to attract that kind of low vibe behavior uh, from guys. Taking full responsibility for yourself and your own well-being as always, beginning on the side of your hand, tapping lightly with two or three fingers. Even though this isn't what I was asking for and this isn't what I expected. Right here and right now, I'm still okay. And I truly and deeply love and accept myself anyway. Even though I didn't want a picture of anyone's privates. I didn't want a picture of any dude's dick. And I did not want a picture of this person's junk. I never asked for this. Right here and right now, I'm still okay. And I truly and deeply love and accept myself anyway. Even though this came with all kinds of emotions and I feel violated and disappointed and I never asked for this right here and right now I'm okay and I truly and deeply love and accept myself anyway I never wanted this I didn't ask for it what did I do or say that gave anyone the impression that I wanted a picture of his junk what did I do or say that made this person think they could send me a picture of their dick without me asking for it? This is unnecessary. It's uncalled for. I feel violated. I feel disappointed. I hope this guy was a better guy. I had hopes for this person. I'm looking for a connection. I'm looking for a good friend, a good date, good conversation, a boyfriend, a partner. What I wasn't looking for was an unwanted picture of some dude's dick. I didn't want that. I don't want that. Why would he send that? I don't understand how he thought this was a good idea. All of this emotional response I acknowledge my emotional response. I acknowledge my disappointment. I acknowledge my feelings of being violated. I acknowledge feelings of being disrespected. I acknowledge feelings of disgust. I acknowledge the feelings of anger. I acknowledge any emotions connected to this experience. I don't know why he thought this was a good idea. I don't know why he thought that's what I wanted, but I didn't ask for it. I didn't ask for this. And I acknowledge any emotions that came along with receiving it. Back to the side of your hand, even though I didn't want a picture of any dude's junk, but I got one anyway. Right here and right now, I'm still okay. And I truly and deeply love and accept myself anyway. Even though a picture of some dude's dick was not on my, my list of goals today, right here and right now, I'm still okay. And I truly and deeply love and accept myself anyway. Even though I didn't ask for this, and I don't understand why guys send pictures like this, right here and right now, I'm okay. And I truly and deeply acknowledge all of my feelings, good or bad. And back to your eyebrow point, I didn't ask for this. 
This is not what I wanted. It's not what I asked for. It isn't what I was expecting. And I'm taking this time to acknowledge any emotions that may have come up after getting a picture that I didn't ask for. How uncreative. How uncreative can guys be? How uncreative. I deserve a guy who's a little more interesting. I deserve a guy who can be a little more creative about how he connects with me. I want someone who thinks these things through. I don't have a relationship with this person. We don't have a relationship that gives him permission to send me a picture like that. And he doesn't even realize that he's ruining any connection we did have. How uncreative. And how disappointing. How disappointing. I'm disappointed that that's what he chose to do. I'm disappointed. How uncreative. How disrespectful. All these feelings. All these feelings. And I'm back to the side of your hand one more time, even though I'm really tired of receiving dick pics. I didn't want them. I didn't ask for them. And I got them anyway. Right here and right now, I'm still okay. And I'm open to attracting new means of connection. Even though I never asked for this. And I acknowledge any feelings of shock I may have had. Right here and right now, I'm still okay. And I choose to be open to new methods of connection. Even though I'm not sure why a guy would choose such an uncreative move. Right here and right now, I am okay. And I choose to be open to attracting a different type of person, no matter what vehicle of dating I'm using. Back to your eyebrow point. I acknowledge any feelings that came along with this image. I acknowledge all of my feelings of frustration about modern dating. I'm frustrated. I'm trying to find a good relationship. I'm trying to find an interesting connection. And all I seem to get are guys who send me pictures of their dicks. And I'm tired of it. I'm tired of this whole dating scene. I'm tired of attracting men who don't listen. I'm tired of attracting men who don't respect me. I'm tired of attracting men who think the best way to connect with me is by sending me a surprise picture of their junk. I'm tired of attracting men who think the best way of connecting is surprise pictures of their dicks. Maybe it's possible that I can be open to the possibility of attracting a different caliber of man. Maybe I can be open to adjusting my own vibration and my own energy to only accept connections from men who don't feel the need to surprise me with pictures of their junk. Maybe I can shift my own vibration. I choose in this moment to shift my own vibration. I choose in this moment to no longer be available for men who just want to send me pictures of their dicks. I choose in this moment to no longer be available for shallow methods of connection like this. I choose right now that I am no longer available for shallow connection. I choose right now to open myself up to deeper, more meaningful relationships and deeper, more meaningful potential relationships. I choose in this moment to be open to deeper connection and to no longer be available 
for shallow connection. I choose to raise my vibration so that all the men who are sending unsolicited dick pics are no longer on my radar. I'm no longer available for surprise pictures of people's junk. And any emotions that I had with this picture or any other picture are just pointing me in the direction of refining my selection. Thank you for the opportunity to refine my selection. Thank you for this opportunity to refine my selection of men. Thank you for this opportunity. I acknowledge all of those emotions as pointing me in the direction of refining my selection. I am no longer available for shallow connection. I am no longer available for surprise pictures of dicks. And I shift my energy in this moment above the picture I just received. And I'm no longer available for shallow connection. Taking a deep breath in through your nose, out through your mouth, and then pressing or tapping one more time on your gamut point, which is a powerful acupressure point between the knuckle of your pinky and the knuckle of your ring finger. And repeating after me, there are parts of me that have been healed by this. And there are parts of me that have not yet been healed. The parts of me that have not yet are willing to learn from the parts that have. My mind, body, spirit, and energy system are accepting that information now. New neural pathways. The information transfer is complete. I'm grateful. Thank you. Together, divine. One more deep breath in through your nose, out through your mouth. And post tapping is a great time to take a few moments to journal or write about any feelings or emotions, thoughts or memories that may have come up while you tapped. Feel free to visit this video and any others as many times as you need to. Thank you so much for joining me.